For more information, visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com Thank you. Now we are going to discuss think and discuss problem page number 196 chapter 8 similar triangles. First question is that give some more examples from your daily life where scale factor is used. So scale factor is used in a drawing maps and designing machines, building designs. Second question is that can you say that a square and rhombus are similar discuss with your friends. In square all sides are of equal length and each angle is equal to 90 degrees. In rhombus all sides are equal but each angle is not equal to 90 degrees. So we can say that in square and rhombus sides are in the same ratio but angles in square and rhombus are not same. Going to discuss, think, discuss second problem page number 196. In this problem it is given are any two rectangles similar justify your answer. To discuss this one we take two rectangles with different measurements. First one is A, B, C, D with the measurements 2 and the 6 as where up adjacent sides and in rectangle E, F, G, H measurements of adjacent sides are 3 and 7 centimeters. We already know that in rectangle each angle is equal to 90 degrees. Next we have to find the ratio of the corresponding sides. Here ratio of corresponding sides AB by HE is equal to 2 by 3 which is equal to 0 0.66 and another corresponding sides ratio is AD by HG is equal to 6 by 7 which is equal to 0 0.71 0 0.66 is not equal to 0 0.71 therefore we can say AB by HF is not equal to AD by HG so we can say that two rectangles are not always in the same ratio but corresponding angles of any two rectangles are equal. Please like, share, subscribe our channel for latest updates by pressing the bell icon. For more information visit our website and blog www.mathswithnasir.com and www.mathswithnasirblogspot.com Thank you.